Some of my recent videos have featured double sideband rigs. They are simple to build and fun to use. However, when conditions are poor, every dB counts. Unlike high power, where a loss of 3 dB can go unnoticed, with QRP, 3 dB can make the difference between being readable and not being readable, between a successful contact and one that the other station signs because they can't hear you. Today I'm trying an SSB rig. An SSB rig concentrates all the power in the one sideband and what for what it is 3 dB superior to a double sideband transceiver. VK 3YE portable testing. A lot of you will be asking about what's inside the transceiver and maybe one to circuit. Well, it is very, very similar to Drew Diamond's TCF series of transceivers. These were designed for 40 and 80 metres. They use any 602s in both the receiver and transmitter. There are two crystal filters, hence the name TCF, one for the transmitter and one for the receiver. Though it requires a few more crystals, it made construction a lot easier because there wasn't so much switching between transmit and receive. The transmitter and receiver are more or less independent, except for the VFO. The other key components included were a 741 used for the microphone amplifier and also the audio preamp and also an LM386 used for the audio amplifier. Three transistors lift the output up to about 2 to 4 watts on 40 or 80 metres. The transceiver does both CW and SSB. CW is accomplished by unbalancing the balance modulator. Uh, 2 watts of SSB, fair enough. Well, you're doing a pretty good job here, Peter. You're, uh, you're 5 9. 5 9. There you go with him, Dave. Do you uh, copy uh, Peter at all, over? Oh, yes, yes, I certainly do. You've got a high dental level of Tasmania, and that's you're running with a 2 watts. Yeah, you could. You could pretty much choose high, Peter. Yeah, I could do a real Peter. I think not. And, uh, whoa, 3 watts. That's not a lot, but you're a good F6, F7 here from Chelsea there, so quite good. And it sounds okay too. Laurie here. Uh, you're right, Peter. Yes, you're coming good. 5 and 8 to 9, drop down a bit. That's your portal running 2 watts out uh, on, the show, on the famous Chelsea Beach. It's terrific, Peter. Nice signal. What if it's a homebrew or what are you running there? Front of the antenna? Is the end set quarter wave or something? VK3 Yankee Echo, VK3 CAW in the group. Uh, Peter, um, you're five and nine with me, and in fact uh, creeping just slightly over the uh, strength nine. So uh, very good uh, signal. Lima one, golf kilo bravo. And I'm situated uh, 15 kilometers north west of Auckland. Uh, and we're got Darren, uh, Victor kilo two, uh, November, 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 and Keith, Victor kilo two. Hotel Kilo Mike on the side. So I'll hand it back to you. Uh, VK3 Yankee Echo. Good old one. GKB. That's great, Peter. Got most of uh, almost all of that. Um, you down on the noise here, you're a uh, you're five by five um, uh, in between the static crashes here. Um, and uh, 2 watts QRP, that's pretty incredible. And, and it sounds like you're sitting on the beach or you're near the beach. Um, and uh, I didn't quite get the location there, but um, 